Oh, hey, boss. What's happening? A new employee? Yeah, I'll teach them the basics. Oh, hey. How are you? Oh, wow. They're pretty cute. Hmm? Oh, sorry. Nothing's wrong. Yeah, my name's Don. What's your name? That's a cute name. It's so nice to meet you. Yeah, I mean it. It is a cute name. So, what we're going to do is learn how to face our products. Yeah, all we got to do is pull the product forward from the back and some of these products we got... And some of these products we need to make it look like a wall at the front. Yeah, do it just like that. You're learning pretty quickly. Sadly, the aisle that we're working on has all of these cans. Cans really are a pain to face. I hope it's not too much for you. I mean, it's not necessarily hard. It's just super tedious. Oh my god. Those cans never get old. They are always a mess and we always have to organize them. It's crazy. Alright. This aisle has a lot of stuff we need to face and organize. Oh wait. You know what? Make sure you don't forget the tea. Yeah, a lot of people forget about the tea in the middle. So make sure you don't forget about it. I know it's weird since it's literally right there smack dab in the middle, but it's a common mistake. Wow, they're really cute. They're actually quite talented. I know it's not recommended that we date our co-workers, but... I wouldn't mind going out with him sometime. Hmm? Oh, it's done? Let me check out what you did. Awesome. You remember the middle T. So many people forget about it. You're going to be great here. Oh, wait. Yeah, you want to stack some of these coffee packages and pull a couple of them forward. Yeah, make sure you cover the dots at the front of the shelves. I know it sounds silly, but you gotta make sure they're covered. Also, try to use both hands when doing any tasks of the job. Management will give you crap if you're only using one hand. It's much more effective to use both hands. So are you in school too? Awesome, where do you go? That's a good school. What are you studying? Sounds interesting. I hope it's not too rough for you. Maintaining a school work balance is necessary, but rough, sadly. Yeah, I've been there. It's not always easy. So, you must have a partner, right? You don't have a partner? That's surprising. Uh, well, um... <clears throat> well, you seem super nice and you're pretty cute, so I figured you were taken. Did I call you cute? I'm sorry if that was awkward. I sometimes don't realize what I'm saying until it's too late. It's okay? Thank God. I'd hate to have creeped you out on the first day. I did mean what I said, though. I know we just met and... It's not always recommended that employees date each other. But if you're interested in going out sometime, I'm definitely open. Yes, I'm serious. You're really nice, super cute, so I'd love to go out with you sometime. You'll think about it? That's not exactly the answer I hoped for, but it's not a no at least. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no. Don't apologize. If anything, I should be the one apologizing. It's really okay? Oh, 
You're really great. Yeah. Let's get back on track here. God, why did I say that? It was so stupid. I shouldn't just ask someone right away. I mean, I know there are stories of strangers to lovers, but it really isn't as common as it seems, sadly. I mean, I have to get to know them first. Oh no, I'm okay, don't worry. Hold on a second, I am getting a message from the boss. Okay, all right. Got it, boss. So, I'm going to teach you how to stock milk now. So, did you happen to bring a coat with you? No? Oh dear. It gets a bit cold in the walk-in cooler. We'll just have to make it quick. Or, you know what? Here, wear my coat. Oh, <laughs> don't worry. It's clean. And here it is. A walk-in dairy cooler. As you can see, these are the doors people use to get the milk, and we can see the customers from the inside. Oh, silly. They can see us too. They probably don't notice it because you'd really have to know what you're looking for. But yes, they can see us from the outside too. Alright, we're finally done. God, it's a bit cold after a while. Oh no, I'll be fine. I was just more worried about you, cutie. Oh dear, there I go again, calling you cute. I really mean it. I'd like to get to know you more. You're a really nice person. Here, I'll give you my number. Here it is. Yep. Text or call me whenever you want. Well... Obviously not on the job. I mean, management would get mad if you were on your phone on the clock. You're happy I helped you? Oh, thank you so much. I'm not always too great when it comes to training new people, so I'm glad you thought I did a great job. Hey, listen. Think about my offer. It's okay if you don't want to, but I really do want to get to know you better. I believe you're quite the catch. Luckily, the day's about to end. I hope you had a great first shift. I'm glad. What day do you work next? Oh, great. I work that day, too. I'll see you then. Goodbye for now, cutie.